What's up YouTubers, Crispy Ballin here and today I will be showing you how to import a 3D LUT or multiple 3D LUTs from your Windows PC computer onto your Atomo Shogun and I will also be showing you how to record with that LUT applied on your Shogun. Alright guys, the first step we're going to do is we're going to unplug our SSD from the Shogun and plug it directly into our PC using the transfer cable that came with your Shogun. Plug that into your PC. Alright, once you have plugged in your Shogun into your desktop computer, we're going to go open up the Shogun folder. As you can see, mine is completely empty. We're going to hit Control N to open up a new window. We're going to go to our Windows C folder. We're going to hit View. We're going to select Hidden Items. We're going to go to Program Data. We're going to go to Blackmagic Design because I'm using DaVinci Resolve 11. That's where I store all of my LUTs. Yours may be different. You might be using Adobe, you know, whatever. I'm using DaVinci Resolve. We're going to click that. We're going to go to Support. We're going to hit on LUT. And I'm just using this as an example. I'll be importing the M31 3D LUT. So we're going to select that. We're going to just drag it onto our Shogun folder. Okay. We're going to safely remove our hardware, our Shogun. All right, once you've done that, we're going to take your SSD, slide it right back into the Shogun. We're going to power it on. Give it a few seconds to turn on. Okay, now we're going to select this little yellow button here, which is our LUT folder. Now, as you can see, I've already done this. I have mine maxed out. You're allowed a maximum of eight 3D LUTs applied at once. Okay, but I'm going to show you how to do this. We're going to hit this little folder here. This shouldn't say do you want to overwrite because you might, your, all of yours might be empty at the time. You're going to hit OK. You're going to select the LUT that you want to install into your Shogun. You're just going to simply double click it. It should say loading LUT. Okay. And as you can see, we have our LUT installed right there. It's number five. Like I said earlier, mine are all maxed out. I have a maximum of eight LUTs, which is the maximum the Shogun allows you to do. Next, I'll be showing you how to capture video with that 3D LUT applied. All right, guys, now I'm going to be showing you how to record with your LUT selected. I'm using the Sony A7S with the Picture Profile 1. Now, please note I am using the latest Shogun firmware, which is version 6.4. We're going to click right here where it says 4K UHD and the frame rate. And where, where it says record, we're going to select 3D LUT on. So that's enabling you to record with the 3D LUT selected. So let's go ahead and select the M31. We're going to hit MON LUT. Okay, you can see that flashing. That means that you are recording with the LUT applied. You can hit record. Just to show you that this does work, I'm going to hit play. And as you can see, it recorded with the 3D LUT that I selected. You've been watching another Crispy Ball tutorial. Please make sure to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And thank you for watching.